Last night, a back and forth ball game. Today, it is Hayes. Uh, but of course, the most percent. So a great day in that regard. And the first strikeout of the afternoon for Luzardo. He has what they call easy gas. He Nolan Arenado on a hop right over towards short for Wendell. Uh, good. Davis in center field. And it'll be around for a little while. First pitch is fouled straight back. With the curveball not as reliable. Directed into center field, in fact. It's left center field, Gat arise on his way to hold him right there. A double strikes. Line and caught by Arenado, but nobody home at second base, so Soler. Anything needed. Enter and a three. The curveball, this was up in the zone, but you really. Another couple of first inning runs yesterday. Three. Base hit into center field. Oh, and Goldie on the corners. DeYoung and Edmund up the middle. Second most in franchise hitter, and it will drop down. Cooper a chance. Who's trying to leave Marmol? Handling a. I think the the thing that puzzles me. I, I know Wayne Wright. Twisting in right, reaching up and making the. That was a. Fouled away. One, two to Fortes. And that's a called strike three. Fortes at center. Luzardo goes back to work. And the first pitch strike to Wilson Contreras. The D in the outfield. Joey's at uh, shortstop. Field. Sanchez going back. And that goes in quick. Throws a strike. to, And that helped to make that a close play. Yeah, he was anticipating base. making the throw. But Luzardo strikes him out. That's down and in. Three in last night's game, and they between second and third. Segura feeds Wendell, and now Wendell feeding. 2 1 is down and in. Stream Miami Marlins baseball live in the Valley's. Missed inside. For and four and a third. Seven hits. By the way, I love the Marlins Fourth of July hats. Almost as nice as that slider from Luzardo. You see, here's the thing. Uh, great effort there, Chess. But if you watch Bartle. Oh, makes the catch in foul territory. One of wins. So they'll come east after that. And then the Braves go to the. Here's a 2-2. The middle. Position perfectly. De Young makes the layer. And that the vintage curveball here and the growth from Landry Kisner to start the inning. I remember last year, last year more towards first base. I wasn't wasn't as linear to home plate as I was last year. Um, that day, and I knew the bullpen wasn't. Um, we weren't fully stocked and whatnot. But as we've seen, Jesus Luzardo here, a fellow lefty in that rotation, just. He's been due runner on first and two outs. There's a base hit. Kisner takes the throw, goes to second to keep him on. Long man at times, or that pro. So much so that you have offered a whole other half this year. And last year, as I said in the break a little while ago, you almost won a bit during the game. Yeah, a little. It's just come with throwing it in the grass every day, throwing it in bullpens. And that was a time where I kind of tinkered with it on the left side or down. And I kind of threw a curse. There's still some work to do for sure. Deep right center and Garrett Ooh. Cooper. You guys got some pop. Uh, you guys for sure, especially in this first half. And the highest strikeout per among National League starting rotations. Hey, like that. Yeah. Jesus Luzardo back to work and a strike to Contreras, then Walker and one, two. And another great slider right there. That when you look at that uh, chart, where his pitches have been, Stat and because he had the location, days, of course, to uh, bring some coverage to you. Ground ball to short. Wendell in the. You know, there and healthy toward the end of the season. Now, we saw that last night with Dylan Carlson. Three, two, and two outs, and the pitch just a little bit up.
looks like a rise is there. About it a lot. And uh, they're able to feed off that energy. Nick Fortes, who leads off home runs today. That's inside, and it's got a piece of Fortes. That's what we need, Paul. We need a plan B, a plan. Not. And a curveball, a swing, and a miss. Sometimes that spot is a pinch hit spot, or a pinch why a rise has played such great defense. That is a foul ball, just. And he's on base again. That'll boost that 460. And you think that, why? Because the walks take at bats off the board in terms of on base guys. Yeah, Joey Votto, career yeah. over 400 on base. Here, Adam Wainwright will fall short. Here comes the 3 1. Tapper back to the mound, and Romero couldn't. Sanchez. Ball outside. To Goldschmidt. He comes home with it. They'll get one there. His Cooper base is still loaded. Swings over the top of a changeup. One for two career against Romero. Left field. One run is home, and here comes second. Sometimes the eye test tells you that Coop is the guy you want. Still not done. First and second. And down low to Segura. Runners go, and it's taken low. For the final out. But the Marlins get three in the on tonight. Back to our regularly scheduled programming tomorrow. A up the middle. Something about that defensive position. The ballpark, the comeback. All good. This is a center field. Almost able to hold this. Sitting. Some of the other guys the Marlins have can. Kayla Cruz got to the wall and took a step in to make the. Not 0 for 2. Ground foul. I would say uh, yeah, it's a moot point. Good appearance. And Luis Arise to a third this in. Walker in his tracks, one away. Here he is, one and two. Strikes through 95. Top of the order, Arise takes a strike. Fastball at the top of the zone. And midway through this one. And Arise down on strikes. 2K. Providing their thoughts on this fourth. Wilson Contreras with another hit. Bouncer to third. That's one. That on the Today Show, I think it was one of the news shows. Uh, nice. <laughs> All right. We'll work on finding cameras. Yeah. You brought up the point. Fly ball to right. 48 ERA. But in terms of one three game stretch, game stretch, but you really love the fact that, uh, at least at this point, is running 3 2. Sanchez with a base hit to right field. Outside to Cooper, who's had a good day. Cooper takes low. And One ball, no strikes. Segura takes a strike. And Cabrera deals. Oh. Too short. A double. I think it might be a little more focus on from Jesus Luzardo. Mound, hop or two to arise. I know what I was going to ask you. Who, okay. do, you, who do you like? Uh, who do you like? The foul ball. And uh, really. And Newt Bar takes a strike. Newt Bar waves and misses at takes inside ball and no strikes yeah the cart double in the fifth and it takes a strike condition but left looked like he was holding over for him and Myers will put that one away for the final out eight spot in the order field gives it a ride that is gonna get down we went thinking Romero and Cabrera after that 
And Fortes is contusion for Jonathan Davis. And he's undergoing further evaluation, including an extra. As a base hit, drive in a run. Being a complete team win. And this has been another one of those. A couple of knots for Soler. See, what did I tell you? More plate discipline. Plate discipline staying off. Left center, right there. It will run his home. Here. And for Soler. Soler at second base. Fights it off. Nothing in one. Forward. That's what they've talked about. But here De La Cruz comes up empty. But uh, again, another. Jesus now with a. Five game hitting streak with the a walk to arise. The double for Sanchez through the left side. That's where the Marlins tack on. Well, that bat is way up to center. Playable for Newt Bar. Marlins get four more. by the coach, but not uh, Mom. She was up in good stuff, guys. For my team has been getting it done. Yeah, and Gabby, you know as well as anybody, it's contagious too. Once, uh, Thanks so much, Paul. Yes, I'm with Danes. And uh, Rhonda, you were just telling me, I don't know if I'm getting mean, and she was filming. Um, I was at a lost her words and I fell to my knees. Baseball trip. How much does today make all of that work? Yes, his early time in the minor details. Outside to Joey Wendell. Thinning with a double. Came in to score the Marlins biggest offensive inning with the four run series championship. Field gets down and that on his way to third. They hold him there. The fourth. Takes a strike right there. Ball to third. That's Nolan Gorman. Over to Alec Burke. Fouls that one off. Poked foul. Outside. Center field. Wendell stops at third. John Birdie to pinch hit. Takes a ball up and in. He's pinch hitting for Luis. Birdie into the corner. Two more. But ball here. Cardinals will make the call of the bullpen who pinch hit for Goldschmidt and took. But uh, Skip Schumacher talked about it last night. One series dictate the whole. And down for a base just to make sure it wasn't going to get. And Cruz fouls that one away. Nothing in two. Foul back still 0 2. That's the way things have gone. Two now is perfectly fine, even though it's off of. That one inside. So the Marlins had a 19 hit. And a strike up and in. Sanchez. Field. Looks playable for Newt Bar. Negative 21 coming in, even when this one's all said and done. Eight.